Good to have you back with us on The Café. We're very lucky because joining us now are Lauren Scopel, who is an aerial artist, and Charlene Romelay from France, who is a figure skater. And they are stars of the smash hit show Ice Age Live. It is so nice to have you here. Thanks for joining us in The Café. Thank you for having us. Yeah. Welcome. Now, first up, I must say I've seen the show and I thought it was incredible. Um, I couldn't spot either of you. Can you tell me who you play or is that a, a closely guarded secret? We can say, I mean, like, I'm, I'm a skater, yeah. and in the show, what I'm doing, I'm skating, actually. So when you see some skating parts, you can guess that it can be me. It could be but you. But it's hard to know because we are so many of us on the stage in the same time, so it's hard to recognize. And for Lorraine, it's like different activities that I do, so. Yeah, well, the thing that's, that amazed me is I wasn't quite expecting it, because it's on the ice, obviously, but there is a lot of stuff that happens that's not on the ice as well, and that's where you come in, isn't it, Lorraine? Yeah, we have um, aerial acts, rhythmic gymnastics, there's also martial arts. So I think it's quite rare that there's one production with so many different types of artists, so that's, that's quite special. When you started, Charlin, ice skating, how old were you? I was five. Did you think that you would end up touring around the world, visiting different countries and doing it for a living? When I, when I stepped on the ice first time, I, would, I knew it was like the spot for me. Right. And um, I did competition for many years, but my dream was to one day do shows. And uh, I really wanted to do. And I guess like when you really want something, then you can get it if you... You never wanted to head to the Olympics down that route? Mm, I was more about the shows. I did like some really like amazing competitions, like with my coach at home, and I had a, I mean I had great moments during my career as as a competitor. Sorry, but uh, I really don't regret the way I took as a showgirl. I really I, love it. I tell you what, I can listen to her accent all day. <laughs> it's just beautiful. Um, Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> now, Lauren, I must ask you, what's your involvement with the show? So you do the, the acrobatics and things? Yes, yes. So I'm an aerialist, but originally I was a rhythmic gymnast, so that's my background. So I do a couple of different um, things in the show, but not ice skating. So There's obviously a lot of different nationalities in the show. I mean, how did you all come together? We are, I mean, like, there is like more than 10 nationalities in the show and the main language we are talking is English, of course, because like we are coming from so many different countries, like English, Chinese, French, Spanish, Australia, uh, like so many different nationalities. So to bring it all together, I would say like passion. That's how it works. I wanted to know, because obviously it's high impact and Mal said it was just incredible what you guys were doing. Have you had any injuries or mistakes during a live show? Because this is Ice Age Live. It is live. <laughs> yes, we make mistakes all the time. Um, so have you had any disasters? No. I, I mean, like, it's a live show. So, you know, like, it's, it's, a, it's, it's live. So there is always, like, so many things going on in, on stage and as well behind. So there is, what should, should I say, like, there is... Of course, like sometimes injuries, mm. but we use as an artist like to work so hard since many years. I would say it's and we can mm. hold, but of course, so like, if, you, if you fall over, you've just got to get back up yeah, again. Yeah, it happens. And pretend it doesn't hurt. It, it, and it really can, does hurt. It can and happen. Mm. And Lauren, mm. you've been in New Zealand now for over a week. Yeah. Um, how have you found? Have we been looking after you? Absolutely, and uh, it's my second time to New Zealand actually, because many years ago I did the New Zealand National Championships here for rhythmic gymnastics. Wow. So I have been around before, but um, yeah, it's, Obviously quite it's close to Australia where I'm from. So a different neighbors. tour here. Do, yeah. you, do you get much downtime on the show? I mean, what have you seen around town? Uh, yeah, we usually get the first few um, days off in the week, but yes, because I've been here before, I'm sort of more focused on the show this time than uh, travelling around, but some of the other cast have definitely been around. Now, for those who don't know, tell us what the show is all about. It's like, a, I would say, a mix of the three first movie of Ice Age Live. So, and as you can see, like, there is all the herd which is like all the characters, the principal characters of the, of the movie. The sloth is there. Oh, nice. The sloth, yeah. Sid, of course, and Manny, Ellie, Scrat, Peaches, they're all together. And they're going through different 
wonderful world. And this is like the main, what is happening during the show. Like they're going to through different, yeah, wonderful worlds. It's an exciting show to watch. I know, and I was just thinking too, it must be incredible when you're a performer and you are putting on a show that's family friendly, because I guess for the first time you get to see the reactions of kids' faces. That must be one of the most incredible parts of each night. What is it like, Lauren, feeling that from the kids? Well, it's um, down in, uh, in Finale, depends on the country, but often the kids come down to the characters at the end and they're just full of so much joy and it's hard to keep them off the ice sometimes. <laughs> so I can imagine you need so big nice. bounces around actually because, yeah, there was a few kids trying to get on when I was there, that's for sure. I would have mm -hmm. been up there too. I used to ice skate once upon a time. Oh, I know. We were going to have a challenge. We might still, since you're in New Zealand, might still do that. Hey, thank you so we much do. for coming in. I really appreciate it. Uh, good luck you. with the rest of the tour. It's been a uh, pleasure. So the, you guys heading off to Wellington now? Now, and mm -hmm. there's also Hamilton. There's actually been a new show added in Hamilton. All the details you can find uh, here on the cafe and also at Ticketmaster. Yep. If you do want to go do that, get tickets, ticketmaster.co.nz.